guys, this is just a quick update video on uh, the three-phase energy meter I started building last week. If you haven't already, hit subscribe, hit that like button to follow on the series. Alright, so again, this is just the voltage and current monitoring circuits feeding into the energy metering IC and uh, the SPI terminals into an Arduino Mega. Now to get the current and voltage uh, to simulate them, I'm using this time, I'm using a Omicron CMC156 relay test set. Now these relay test sets are used for the uh, testing of protection relays used in uh, transmission and distribution network. So not really uh, this type of stuff, but it actually, you know, can do the job. So, uh, so one mistake I did make so far is I thought the pins on the energy meter were 5 volt tolerant. So they're not, but it's still going to work for a little while, but eventually will die. So I will have to get another one down the track to fix that. So I'll fix that later on. Alright, so I'm using two PCs. One for the running of the test set and the other for the coding of the Arduino. And uh, display. So, I'll turn it on and let's have a look at how it works. So turning it on, we'll have a look how it uh, works. Now I've had to do the voiceover because that unit is particularly loud. So here's me inputting some variables. So 63 volts on each channel I'm going to put in and then 1 amp to begin with. Then I'll turn it on and, in, and I'll update the screen that's I've inserted on the display. So I've written that program into vb.net but uh, this is not the final product this is just so I can get the data out quickly without having to look at it line by line from the serial monitor so I'm going to go ahead and adjust some of these angles and uh, have a look at the effect that that has on the readings so you can see uh, as soon as I change them and I update it that I'm getting the new readings come in so now, I'm going to try a couple different angles and show you the effect of each one. You can see also that the uh, voltage and the currents are a little bit out. Uh, they're in ballpark, but uh, I haven't uh, full-on calibrated them yet. There's, that's going to happen later on. Um, it does take time to do that. Alright, so you can also see I've adjusted the frequency and you can see it update on the screen. Uh, tune in next week or maybe a week and a half away and I'll uh, have another video with where I'm going.